Hello everyone. Now in this session we'll have to discuss the modified duo binary encoder with and without precoder. First of all, without precoder we'll see, and then later on with precoder. Now why it is called as modified uh, duo binary encoder? So little bit modification has been done here as compared with the previous duo binary encoder. What kind of modification? So if you see the delayed version so in the previous case we have only delayed the input sequence by a single duration that is single tb but whereas in this case the delay is now of two duration two tb this is what only the difference in uh, in this modified duo binary and the duo binary encoder uh, rest of the things are same so we'll discuss one by one first of all we are applying input binary sequence bk it may have either zero value or one value and this is first of all given to the lever shifter it is giving us the output ak so if zero we will get minus one value of ak if it is one then we will get the plus one value of ak now at the output that is ck uh, ck is the output of this subtractor where two inputs one input ak as it is and the ak input is delayed by two bits that is ak minus two so what is the value of ck it is ak minus ak minus 2 so that is what i have written here ak minus ak minus 2 now this is what the transmitted sequence will have to now decode this and we wanted the original sequence bk so therefore coming to the receiver sequence now so this is what the decoder side a received sequence first of all we can give it to the summer where the another input is from the ak cap so what is this ak cap ak cap is the estimation of ak so we are going to estimate the value of ak means ak is actually the input it is coming from the input and we are going to estimate it so ak cap is the estimation of ak now this ak cap is delayed by 2 tb duration here so ak cap minus 2 so in order to estimate first uh, first of all this receiver should know what kind of ak value is also used otherwise it cannot uh, uh, decode the original sequence so this is ak minus 2 is the delayed version of this ak by 2 bit so what is the value of ak cap we are getting here ak cap is nothing but this ck plus ak minus 2 i have written this as now this ak cap we can give it to the decision device where the threshold level we can set it to the zero and how output is supposed to make the decision so in output bk cap value output of this decision device is zero if this ak cap is less than zero and it is one if ak cap is greater than zero that's it so this decision device uh, decision is very important this output is zero if ak cap is less than zero output is one if ak cap is greater than zero means threshold value so now let us see the example of this uh, modified duo binary encoder without precoder this is what the problem statement of uh, modified duo binary encoder without precoder the binary data 0111 are applied to the input of the modified duo binary system Question number one, construct the modified duo binary coder output and corresponding receiver output without a precoder. So here we'll have to calculate the encoder output that is CK as well as the decoder output means the original sequence BK. Question number two, suppose that due to the error in the transmission, the level produced by the third digit is reduced to zero. So this said like the error is now received in the third digit. Uh, sorry, not this, actually the transmitted sequence in the third transmitted bit error is generated and it is reduced to the zero so construct the new receiver output we'll see later later how exactly we'll get the output there so let us focus on the first question now so i have prepared here a table already this is what the table for calculation of encoder and decoder output so first of all I can write this input sequence 0 triple 1 0 0 1 0 1 I have already written this that is what the input binary sequence BK now I can write the bipolar sequence AK first of all I need to consider the initial value of AK so either you can consider plus one value or minus one even though you are considering minus one you will get the same answer same received sequence here so here I am considering plus one now what is AK? AK is actually the uh, shifted version. Uh, when this signal is passing through the level shifter, we are getting AK. So this 0 means it is minus 1, 1 means plus 1, 1 means plus 1, 1 plus 1, 0 means minus 1, minus 1, plus 1, 0 means minus 1 and this is plus 1. So 
this binary sequence is having level shifted output this way now delayed sequence ak minus 2 so we'll have to delay this ak by 2 bit so this plus 1 will be coming here now it is delayed this plus 1 is coming here minus 1 is coming here this plus 1 is coming here this plus 1 is coming here delayed by 2 bit so this plus 1 delayed 1 bit here and delayed 2 bit here so here minus 1 will be here this minus 1 is here and this plus 1 is here so this is ak minus 2 now let us write the value of output of encoder that is ck which is ak minus ak minus 2 so this is ak and this is ak minus 2 let us do the subtraction minus 1 minus 1 is minus 2 1 minus 1 is 0 1 minus minus is plus 1 plus 1 is 2 1 minus 1 is 0 minus 1 minus 1 is minus 2 minus 1 minus 1 is minus 2 1 minus minus is my is plus 2 minus 1 minus of minus is plus 1 is 0 and 1 minus 1 is 0 so we are getting this encoded output now now the next uh, is this is what the encoder now we'll have to look, looking at the decoder side so this is what the ak cap value decoder and then it's a delayed version by 2 bit so whatever the value initial value of ak that i have considered you know ak cap is the estimation so this values must be transmitted to the receiver otherwise reception decoder uh, decoding is not possible so this plus one and plus one i can write as it is now this will be delayed by 2 bits so if plus 1 is here this will be delayed by 2 bits so this plus 1 will be going here and this plus 1 will be going here delayed version now minus and you know ak cap is ck plus ak cap minus 2 so this is ck and this is ak cap minus 2 we will need to simply add this to minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 0 plus 1 is 1 now this minus 1 and 1 will be going here so minus 1 here and this one will be going here so 2 minus 1 is 1 0 plus 1 is 1 1 1 is going here 1 1 this one is here and this one is here minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 now this minus 1 is going here and this minus 1 is delayed by 2 bits so it is going here 2 minus 1 is 1 0 minus minus 1 is plus 1 now this one is going here this one so no more bits available so let it be 0 plus 1 is 1 so this is how we are getting here a ak cap value then finally decision device output that is bk cap so what kind of decision we have made if the value of ak cap is greater than 0 it will be 1 less than 0 it will be a 0 so from here we can write since this value is less than 0 it may come um, since minus 1 so it is 0 it is greater than 0 so 1 1 1 less than 0 so 0 0 1 1 1 so if you see this received sequence 0 triple 1 0 0 1 1 1 it is same as that of the transmitted sequence 0 triple 1 0 0 1 0 1 this is what the encoded and decoded output